watching Power App Solutions in Minutes. In this video we're going to go ahead and provision our first portal and in later lessons uh, we're going to go ahead and um, learn a lot more. So let's go ahead and spin up a portal. We'll give it a name. And then we can define the base URL that will be hosted on Power Apps Portals. But you know what? Let's come up with something a little bit more uh, unique for our address. Same thing with our name for our portal. Since we'll be working with this for a little while. And then we'll go ahead and create it. Now, once we click Create, what what Microsoft Power Platform is going to go ahead and do is it's going to begin provisioning our portal. So up here it says portal provisioning in progress. So uh, it takes some time. Uh, and so what I don't want is for anybody to be sitting here waiting for this to happen uh, because I have to do it as well. Um, so I think this is more than enough for this particular set of uh, lesson. And in our next video, we'll go ahead and cover um, administering a portal. Thank you.